In the history of mankind, has there ever been a more obvious truth than the statement, we are all going to die? A lifetime. How long is it supposed to last? Suffering is something that is passed on from one generation to the next, like flexibility, grace, or colorblindness. How's the writing going? Terrible. Do you think I've peaked? That I'm already on the downside of a largely forgettable career? I see you haven't lost your flair for melodrama. All for you, all right. Yeah, I'm fine. Yoli, your sister. She tried to kill herself. Mom showed me your suicide note. Thank you for putting me on it. You're welcome. I was like two thirds down the list. It was like I was an afterthought. I just didn't want it to go to your head. Of course not. This wasn't a mistake. No, none of this strikes me as a cry for help. At the hospital, she asked me if I'd Thomas Aquinas her. And she must have meant, will I forgive her? She planned it well. I beg to differ. After all, she's still alive. Yes, not like your father. We have heard that Elfrida has expressed a desire to leave the community, to study music. If she goes, she'll get ideas. That's what university's for, isn't it? Will you take me to Switzerland? They have clinics there where dying is legal. But are you thinking at all of the reasons to stay alive? Has it occurred to you that I also lost my father to suicide and I'm having a hard time getting over it? Maybe you're here for a reason, which is to be a sister to me. You don't understand a thing I do understand. Is this almost too much, Mom? Almost. Ours is essentially a tragic age, so we refuse to take it tragically. There is now no smooth road into the future. We've got to live, no matter how many skies have fallen. I don't want to die alone. I don't want you to die alone.